Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we will talk about the fragments in Jira, the script runner plugin which is providing the fragments. So, so what's the use of it and uh, what we can achieve it. To see this thing, let's go to the managers. Search for the fragments. It will come under the script runner. Okay, uh, here as you can uh, read it, use script fragment to customize the user interface and add the new functionality. Use customizable built-in script fragment to display web item, web panel and web section or include JavaScript and CSS resources using web resource. So what is the meaning of that? Uh, just example, if I want to hide something here, okay, I don't want to move any ticket uh in the specific project i don't want to enable the move option i don't want to enable the clone option or i don't want to enable the delete option in the specific project so how you can do you can do with the help of the permission this that is a one thing okay but another thing with the help of uh, um, uh, fragments i want to achieve that one so that is a one example there are multiples are there you can see it so let's create as you can see this much of the options are available custom wave items so wave panels totally used what is the use of it you can use that one based on your uses okay create issue wave panel so hide system or plugin you event i am going to use this one so before showing this one let me open ticket uh, okay jira test this is the ticket come down here you can see move option okay move and clone option you can see but I want to disable these two options come here uh, hide move and clone option in the project hide what just search for move move issue I want to hide hide what clone clone issue I want to hide based on which i want to based on the condition only for one project just come here and provide the jt this that is a project okay if you click on review it's showing the non implemented okay means it's uh, not working okay just click on add come here or refresh the page once you will refresh the page click on more you can still see the move and clone option that means it's not working so how uh, to check it now so click on so documentation will open click on the documentation go there here n number of options are available okay which you can use it it's a very very helpful just go down so see this portal id and coming to here it's showing okay go there do you have uh, any question you can use the atlassian community also or you can create a ticket under the script runner if you are unable to find the solution but here if you will come okay you can find the all the solution which are the available in the here okay search for fragments A script fragments this is the only built-in go down hide ui come down here now i can find the solution so this is as you can see this is for expect one project okay available in all other project but except one project come here click on edit come here control v just search for uh, just type jt project click on preview okay click on update 
now come here refresh click on more see you cannot see now so more and clone option you cannot see so earlier that was not working because due to the condition was not correct but currently i am using the correct condition so it's working i am able to hide it in this project but if you will talk about any other project uh, let's go jira test one create the ticket anything anything create ticket got created click on more see now move and clone options are available in this ticket so like this you can hide anything in the jira with the help of script runner fragments thank you for watching